Hi everyone, I'm Ali from Ali G Art Designs. Thank you for joining my channel. Uh, today um, we are going to look at uh, putting like a monochrome uh, Dutch bloom in to a grey background. Split base, still in the In the Grey series because I'm just loving what's coming out of it and I keep getting more ideas. So I've got to exhaust all that before I can move on. Um, all right, well, let's get started. Uh, I'm definitely going to get messy, um, so let's paint. So here we go. This is my one of my base colors, the lighter color. And this is one of my, the darker one. Um, not much contrast, but we're going to put some beautiful other colors with that. I'm going to be daring and put a little bit of black. Let's see how that goes. Alrighty, um, I'm going to start with the dark color on the bottom. Um, all right, white, global white, and I'm putting that down first. Um, okay, I'm just going to put a little one there and maybe just a little one there. Well, that's a big one, but anyway. All right, and I'm going to, hmm, all right, I'm going to use the black here because it's also an opaque colour, but I'm not going to use too much. I think I might just drizzle a little bit because I'm just scared it's going to sort of completely take over and all I'm going to see is black. Just not what I want. Okay, let's see how we go with that. Um, the next colour. All right, so I've got this colour that I made. I don't know if you can see it in the bottle. It's kind of really shiny. So that's just Payne's Grey from Global. And I've just added the metallic pearl and it's just come up with a real nice shimmer. Looks like a dark silver or something like that. But anyway, let's see how it goes. Uh, should I put that first? Yeah, yeah why not, hey? actually goes really nice with that dark base it looks almost well that dark base has got a little bit of Payne's grey in it all right Whew. okay the next color I'm going to use is silver um, I might just put a little bit of white not much just want to separate them a bit I don't know if that will work but we'll see how we go all right, got silver. Oh, this silver is actually Pebio. Oops, gosh, it's got squeezed too hard there. <laughs> All right, and the last colour, so I don't have a lot of colours, is pearl white. Oh, I hope this works. Now I'm wondering, do I have enough black? I do not know. Maybe I'll just put a little bit.
I do want some contrast. I just don't want it to drown out everything else. Um, oh, the other thing I'm going to be a little bit daring on. Oof, okay, here we go. I have got some Amsterdam and Floetrol. I'm going to put a little bit of cell activator on it. Just a little bit, just to create some interest. And not in every spot. Hope it works in a good way. Oops. Ooh. All right, here we go. Woohoo! Ah, I love a challenge. Oh, I don't know. I might just put a little bit more of this on the outskirts. Because I really love this colour. I'd love it to come through. Just a little bit there too. Yeah, well, there we go. And I might put a little bit more... Uh, a little bit more of this on this side because it's darker. Oh, let's just see how it goes. You've got to give it a go, don't you? Torch. Oh, let's go. All right. Just cover it a little bit. Alrighty. Wow, it's really interesting. Probably would have liked that to have joined a little bit more, so I might just put a little bit there. There's my white. Let's just do some touch ups. A little bit there. Uh, and a little bit of black, uh, not too much. Got my pretty grey there. A little bit of this. And a little bit of what am I missing? Silver. All right. Let's see how we go with that. Um, all right. Oh, that looks lovely. I'll right, just do a bit of mouth blowing. Oh yeah, that's what it needed. Oh, that's come out a lot nicer there. Oh, I like that. All right, a little bit here. Oh, that's really looking nice. It's like looking at, at a black and white movie. <laughs> yeah, getting silly. Oh, 
Oh gosh, it looks like an oyster there. Oh, coming together. I'm just going to put some finger swipes in it and uh, just to kind of bring it together in that botanical look. Where to start? All right. Um, I am going to start. I'm just going to put a little bit of grey here because it's quite dry. So when you do finger swipes, it's really important that when you've done a swipe, that you clean that finger before you do the next swipe. Otherwise, you'll just drag that colour into your next um, finger swipe. You don't really want that. Oops, that didn't come through very well. I love those black outlines. It just really gives it gives it some definition. Oh wow! Love that. Looks like a butterfly wing. Just want to break it up a bit. Uh, yeah, we'll just that straight down there. Um, Oh, you can really see that shimmer in that dark grey colour that I put in there. It's really pretty. I have got a hair in there. Oh, I'm going to use a skewer. Going here, all right. Oh, I'm really loving it. It's very different. I mean, I love color, of course. You know, everything looks beautiful, colorful, but. It's good to explore different things. Ah, let's have a look. Yeah, I haven't done this one yet. Hmm. Oh, I love it. Um. Oh, I love it. Really happy with it. I don't know how it's going to dry. I hope it's not too dark. But we'll see how we go. 
Uh, I'd like that to blow out more, but I think I've given it all it's got. <laughs> A bit more there. Ah, well, there you go. All right, I think let's give it a close up and we'll see how we go. Oh, look at that. Look at that lacing from the Amsterdam or the, the cell activator, which is Amsterdam paint and global. Look at that beautiful pearl and silver coming through. Oh my goodness. What the heck? That is just gorgeous. Loving it. Absolutely loving it. That's just going to look really beautiful dry. Ah, oh, man. What you're actually seeing, I can tell because it's got more colour. See how there's quite a lot of colour in that, that, that shimmer? I actually added a little bit of um, Global Pearl Mist. And I think that's what that is. Because it's got a little bit more colour to it. Whereas normally the... Look at that beautiful lacing. Normally the pearl metallics would just be a white sparkle, whereas you can just see that pearl mix coming through. Well, I'm going to use that a bit more because that is gorgeous. Look at that beautiful blue. Oh, it is so gorgeous. Oh, there you go. That is it. I am very happy with that painting and I think it's very different. I hope you like it. Uh, let's see what it looks like when it's dry. Okay, so here is my monochromatic Dutch pour, botanical Dutch pour, and I am really in love with it. Like, it just looks amazing. Let's just get a bit closer. There's that silver coming out. This is beautiful. Just love that greyish blue that came through there. Got a little bit of lacing happening there. I've got my, I don't know, it looked a little bit like an oyster shell. <laughs> but you know, I really do love it. For something that has no colour, it actually looks like one of my other Dutch pours with lots of colour that someone's just put the black and white mode on. Uh, anyway, I really love it. I hope you love it too. Um, anyway, we'll uh, see you in the next video. Bye.